the morning office for November 6th. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Give praise, you servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. For the Lord is good. Sing praises to His name, for it is lovely. For I know that the Lord is great, and that our Lord is above all gods. Satisfy us by your loving kindness in the morning, so shall we rejoice and be glad all the days of our life. Out of Zion, perfect in beauty, God reveals himself in glory. Let the heavens declare the rightness of his cause, for God himself is judge. Wake up, my spirit, awake, lute and harp, I myself will awaken the dawn. The morning reading is taken from John's Gospel, chapter 15, verses 4 through 5. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Jesus taught us, saying, Remain in me, and I will remain in you. As a branch cannot bear fruit all by itself, unless it remains part of the vine, neither can you unless you remain in me. I am the vine, and you are the branches. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Wake up, my spirit. Awake, lute and harp, and I myself will awaken the dawn. The morning psalm is read from Psalms chapter 72, verses 15 through 17. Long may he live, and may there be given to him gold from Arabia. May prayer be made for him always. May they bless him all the day long. May there be abundance of grain on the earth, growing thick even on the hilltops. May its fruit flourish like Lebanon, and its grain like grass upon the earth. May his name remain forever and be established as long as the sun endures. May all the nations bless themselves in him and call him blessed. Wake up, my spirit, awake, lute and harp, for I myself will awaken the dawn. Glory be to God the Father, to God the Son, and to God the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and will be forever. Amen. Our Father, who is in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. And forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. O God, whose blessed Son came into the world, that he might destroy the works of the devil, and make us children of God, and heirs of eternal life, grant that having this hope I may purify myself as he is pure, that when he comes again with power and great glory, I may be made like him in his eternal and glorious kingdom, where he lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Lord God, Almighty and Everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose. Through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen.